At this point in time, the sun is in full effect, summer's right around the corner, I'm getting black as hell, but despite all of these elements, I'm here on this great day to give you guys a sexy ass cocktail. We're looking at how to make a butterfly south side. Let's go! And remember, if you like what you're about to see, hit that like button, click the subscribe button, and join the smoke committee, because all we got is smoke. Let's go! Now let's take a look at what you're gonna need to make this cocktail. You're gonna want gin, butterfly pea syrup, lime juice, mint leaves, and today's glass of choice, a coupe. And now, it's time to freak out with your ingredients. First, you're gonna want two ounces of your gin, three quarters of an ounce of your butterfly syrup, your butterfly pea syrup. Next, one ounce of your lime juice, And for me, because I'm feeling slightly fancy today, I'm gonna throw some egg whites to get that fluffy texture in my cocktail. So we're gonna be doing a dry shake. You don't need to throw egg whites, I'm doing it for myself. But I'll be adding one ounce of egg whites, which usually equates to an egg white, as far as I know. Now I'm gonna go ahead and give this guy a dry shake to emulsify those egg whites with our cocktail. Let's hope it doesn't explode in my face. Oh yeah. Oh, that's looking real sexy right now. It's looking immaculate. Mm. Wait until you see the pour. Now that our cocktail is emulsified, we're gonna get some ice in our shaker. As always, we're using that Ziploc bag because we're making cocktails at home. Notice how I'm actually using tongs today and not my fingers? I'm a man of class now. I'm moving on up in life. Now let's get this guy sealed up. And shake up some demons. It's always such a forearm workout. Uh, oh my God. Jesus, I need milk. I need all kinds of milk. There we go. I swear with every video, I struggle more and more. <laughs> so I'm just now realizing I should have thrown in a mint sprig to shake with the cocktail to add that minty flavor for the south side. So we're gonna get that shook in one more time with our mint sprig inside. <laughs> now I'm gonna go ahead and grab my coupe out of the fridge. I have it chilling to add even more coolness to our cocktail. Since we have those egg whites in there as well as the mint sprig, we wanna go ahead and double strain our mix. You see it has that beautiful purple color. Dear God, absolutely immaculate. Our garnish for today is gonna to be super simple. We're just gonna take a single mint leaf. We're gonna give it a smack to release those oils and just drop it on top of our cocktail, like so. Placement doesn't really matter. It looks sophisticated enough as is. It just sits on that foam and looks absolutely immaculate. Dear God, I love it. And just like that, our butterfly south side is complete. Now, it's time for our taste rating to see just what we're dealing with. Let's see if I can get this up without spilling anything. Did you see how much I shook that glass just now? I got a serious case of the shakes today, man. I'm like, uh, oh, right, <laughs> the taste rating. Mm. Mm. Ooh. Ooh. Very interesting cocktail, to say the least. I like the, um, I guess, the combination of the lime zing, that explosion that fuses with the floral calmness of your butterfly pea syrup. Let me tell you, this cocktail is sexy to look at. It's simple to make three ingredients and it's super refreshing. A good way to start your summer, good way to end your spring. Let me tell you, give this cocktail a taste because I'm not tripping, man. It's all kinds of flavor, but don't take my word for it. You take that sip and love life. So the funny thing is I've never actually had a South Side. <laughs> I was gonna make a normal South Side, but then I looked at the ingredients and it's like, Hold on, I, I made like five cocktails using almost the exact same recipe or ingredients. So I analyzed it, I'm like, how can I make this cocktail pop? What can I do to add some pizzazz? 
and I realized I had some butterfly pea seeds left in my cabinet. I'm like, yeah, we gonna make this cocktail purple as hell. And here we go. We ended up with this creation. Give it a try, give it a taste. Let me know what you think. Let me know if you like it. Let me know if you don't, because obviously I can take both ends of the spectrum. And I will see you guys when I upload my next video, which will most likely be next week. Because, you know, I'm on that weekly schedule or bi-weekly, depending on how busy my weeks get. But until then, guys, I will enjoy this cocktail. It's May 2-4 right now. I'm going to get outside, get some vitamin D, get blacker, because, you know, I need to get that tan. I need to get that melanin. I need to get that smoke for the summer. But until then, yeah, you guys enjoy your cocktail. Enjoy this video. Like, share, subscribe, you name it. Do what you need to do. And I'll see you guys next week for my next cocktail. Until then, well, yeah, that's all I got. But don't forget, subscribe.